Next is Shelly, number 13. He's going to get jammed up. Looks for, looks for a shot. Looks like a pass behind the hoop, but nobody there. Keeper has the quaffle, he's going to start bringing her up. He's got a solid number of people with him. Behind the hoop. It's a pass, then a shot, no good though. Keeper recovers, blocked again. Come on, CMU, try it. Oh, and a quaffle reset by CMU. One of my favorite strategies, always good for getting your head together, trying to build an offense. You know there's just no hope for that run. Keeper regains quaffle possession, and he's going to bring it up. His chasers are getting set up. No goal. Looks like the assistant refs are asking for a stoppage of play. What are you going to call? Like maybe uh, unnecessary or illegal contact for CMU. I'm not sure though. Jose. Oh, the ref is going to call CMU chaser? Number 65, Wilbur. It's a yellow card. What was the call? Contact from behind for number 65, CMU. I'll take the bitter with the better. Hey, Wilbur. UNC just champed him off with the clock and bringing it out. It's jammed up just past midfield. Quick pass to Shelly. She passed behind the hoop, but the keeper tips it. And he's going to bring it out. He's running. It's a break. Charged by Jambino. It's a no avail. Pass across. And a goal for CMU. CMU first on the board. That was pretty, guys. Good job. Why did he call it? Oh, it's a nickname here. You want to see with the quaffle? It's how he's bringing it in the past midfield. He's got offense to build. A quick pass to nobody. Unfortunately. I thought about it. I was like, well, so can't be his name. And so I was like, well, Sevy's not a name. So I was like, it's gotta be Steve. <laughs> CMU player 65 back in the game after his penalty for contact from behind. CMU keeper bringing it up. Peter's gonna try and recover bludger control. And it's a goal by number 65, CMU. They're gonna score to 49. Interesting budget play happening. UNC comes up with bludger control. Always important in this game of ours. Max Michelli gets beat. Just past the keeper zone. UMC keeper looks like looking like he's gonna sub out, get some fresh legs in. Not a problem. UNC subs out a Peter and a keeper. Number 13, the new keeper for CMU passed across the field, and he's covered by Lee Hodge, but the goal is good. Ten points, CMU. We're gonna score to 39. Five minutes on the secret floor. Max Kelly bringing it up with his keeper. And he's going to spin move, slip the chaser. Uh-oh, looking for a pass, looking for a shot. He's got to do something with it. And it's a close shot, but no goal, just off the rim. Nickel for every time that's happening. CME keeper bringing it up. Pass number 44, and the goal is good. Solid attempt by number 42, UNC's keeper to goal 10 back, but to no avail. Looks like our UNC keeper is going to change out. Come on, Doug! That's the Sully bringing up a shot from the wide left. Unfortunate, the wind definitely. Oh, Ashley! Can I 
Interesting bludgeon play. Sam, you keep bringing it up. Up to the wrap up. Dunk, goal, CMU, bringing the score to 50 0. 50 0 CMU. My apologies, folks. UNC going to start bringing it up. Take the more time. Keep it up, keep it up! Max Michelli. Max Michelli, another shot, but it's wide right. He's it. trying to get on the board so hard. The CMU keeper will recover the ball. He's gonna start bringing it up, try and make something happen. Quick pass number 25 for CMU. Nice There's a shot, but it's blocked by UNC. And it's a race for the quaffle. 81 for UNC. will recover for it. He's going to start bringing it up. UNC has got to get on the board. The secret floor is almost over. Any snitch catch at this point will end the game for CSU. UNC's got to get on the board. Matt's going to bring it up, but he's come. Got some competition here with Landis. And he's telling his feet. Nice kicks back to reset quaffle play. Keeper will recover his reset. Hand off to Michelli to start bringing it up. Michelli walking it up, just to make the field. He's got a shield working for him, but she runs off to get past. They move on land as it was a shot. Who will put it in for 10 points? UNC's first score of the game. Score is now 50 10. Ref will stop play. Looks like it's going to be a card on UNC player Max Michelli. It's interesting to note freshman Lee Hodge not wearing his trademark America sleeve right now. Honestly, I'm a little disappointed. Looks like we've got an injury. Medic is on the field. CMU keeper is down. Looks like maybe a leg issue or something. Something going on with the knee here. Important joint, that. There we go. Good job, keeper. Always like to see him walk away. Even if it didn't hold it all in. You'll see the medic get patched up. No call, ref? Looks like no penalty call. Clean play. Always good. UNC's keeper will have possession. Trying to get some more points on the board. Michelle is bringing it up. Doing some amazing things with the call for today, but hasn't been able to score too many points with it. And it's a pass behind the hoop, but the wind catches it and sails it behind. He's going to bring it up. It's the Lee Hodge. Pass back to Michelle. Overshot. Michelle, he's a little recovered. Almost taken it right out of the hands of Lance for CMU. Quick pass to 81 for UNC. And it's a shot, but caught by the keeper. And now the crop is going the other way. Michelli with a wrap up at number 42, the 42, 14 rather, gets the pass off. Keeper recovers. The UNC walking up the coffin. One minute on the Seeker floor, folks. That's right, one minute for the Seekers are free to hunt my friend James. And you'll bring it up. Almost no defense. A Whoa! shot and goal is good for CMU. This brings the score to 60 CMU, 10 for UNCC. Or UNC rather. I apologize, spectators. We're having a small technical difficulty with our uh, scorekeeper 5000. The wind tends to screw it up. Yeah, we're telling you. Just to reassure you, we are keeping the score on pen and paper. Across pass for UNC. Keeper will 
will cover, but it's beat before he can do anything with it. Facer of UNC for 17 gets tackled and beat. Seekers are free. The secret floor is over. They're just going to hang out because we're cool people. A pass for CMU. Tries to put it through, but no good. Let's go, guys. We need those points. Yeah. You're doing great. Nice job. Clearly, both of these seekers are advocates for eliminating off-pitch seeking. A huge controversy these days in the IQA. Chapel Hill bringing up the ball. Max walking it up as it is the U. Got no competition. Nobody fighting him at midfield. He'll run across. He's trying to make something happen. It's a beat. Biddle with the kick and he'll recover. Resets to build an offense. And James is back on the pitch. CMU almost got. Oh, but CMU Seeker will be beat. Chris Champito bringing it up for Chapel Hill. Looking for a shot or a pass. He gets beat. The goal shot is no good. CMU bringing up the quaffle. James trying so hard not to get caught. Come on, come on. Nice shot, Andy! A pass behind the hoops, and a goal for CMU. Another 10 points for CMU. Bringing the totals is 70 CMU, 10 Chapel Hill. Michelli fighting for the quaffle. Rather get for it. Looking to do something with it. Bludger. And pushes it right through for 10 points. Chapel Hill. Score 70 40. 70 40. 50 shakes. Freshman seeker Lee Hodge playing defense for the seat. For UNC, does not want CMU to catch Sish, does not want to catch it himself. Come on, Jack! We love to see a suicide switch catch this early in the game and in the tournament. Come on, Jack! Chapel Hill is still in the game. They can easily close the gap. Michelli, he's going to walk it up. He's charging through. Stepping in, he's and puts 10 on the board. Oh, no, CMU! Fast break and a good shot. Another 10 points to a year. Let's go to 80 30. Chapel Hill bringing it up. 22 is going to give him the ball. Chapel Hill keeper number 42 is beat. Loses the ball. We'll see who will recover it. Pass across, but it is long to number 55. 55 recovery, he's gonna fight for the goal. A shot, no goal. Snitch is caught, we'll see if it's good. Snitch catch.